working on on the generalization of Fibonacci numbers. Hi, everybody doing today? My name is Crystal Liggins. As she said, I'm from Benedict College. My project is on the generalization of Fibonacci numbers. My project is broken down into three different parts. I will discuss first the introduction, second my motivation to my, who I my work, and third my identity that was in the issue of the Fibonacci code in May 2011 is a whole of the next problem. The Fibonacci sequence is defined as if you start with F1 to be 1 and F2 to be 1. Fn equals the, the addition of the preceding two terms. And this is an example of how the sequence will look. The nuclear sequence is defined similarly to the Fibonacci numbers except we start with L1 to be 1, L2 to be 3, and Ln is the addition of the preceding two terms, which reveals the sequence. Because there are many real-world applications of these Fibonacci numbers, many identities have been discovered and proven. Some of these are the Cassini, in 1680, Catalan, 1879, the Binet, in 1843, with the roots of the quadratic equation in x squared equals x plus 1. And the sum of the first and Fibonacci terms, which, which was discovered by Lucas in 1876. My motivation. Because, there, because of the occurrence of relation, there are many generalizations generalizations that can be made based on the occurrence relation. For example, if you take F1 to be A and F2 to be B, it will come to a, it, it will, the sequence will be built in A, B, A plus B, A plus 2B, 2A plus 3B. If you notice, the coefficients of A and B are Fibonacci numbers. Another generalization that was made because of the Fibonacci sequence is called the Tribonacci numbers, where you start with 1, 2, 1, 1, and 2. And the addition of the three terms will give you the next term, which the sequence will look like it does in the next. Now, finally, the the realization that inspired most of my work was the K Fibonacci numbers. It was discovered by Falcone and Plaza in their study of geometrical properties of the four triangle longest edge partition. They used the complex value, they used complex value functions to devise this generalization. Fk n plus one equals K F N K. I mean K F Kn plus Fkn minus 1 for every n greater than or equal to 1, where k is greater than or equal to 1. This is how the sequence, if you start with 0 and 1, this is how the sequence would work. Because you multiply k times 1 plus 0 will give you k. k K times K plus 1 will give you K squared plus 1. And this is the sequence, but the current relation I'm talking about is if you put if you put 1 into there, K times 1 plus 0 will give you the next term. That's how the sequence will be written. Also, with the K Fibonacci numbers, if you take k equal 1, you will find that you get the classical Fibonacci numbers. If you take k equal 2, you get the Pell sequence. If you take k equal 3, then it will reveal the sequence hn plus 1 equals 3hn plus hn minus 1. Also, there are k Fibonacci identities, just like the Fibonacci identity, such as the same identity, which is a regular Fibonacci identity, but they also have one for K Fibonacci. The Catalan identity, the Binet's formula, 
where r squared equals kr plus 1. And <coughs> sum of the first n term of the k for the natural numbers. The identity that we work on. For k greater or equal to 1, let fk n be the k for the natural sequence. Show that if 2r plus h is not equal to 0, then fk n plus r times fk n plus r plus h plus negative 1 to the h plus 1 fk n minus r, fk n minus r minus h divided by fk 2r plus h equals fk 2n. Now because of the technical, because of the technical and the length of that proof, it was omitted from this, but here's the outline. The problem is split in two cases. When H is even, you use the Catalan identity for K Fibonacci numbers. When H is odd, we proceeded by induction after H. We proceeded after H. If H is odd, we proceeded by induction after proving the following number. F n plus R times F n plus R plus 1 plus F n minus R times F n minus R minus 1 equals F 2R plus 1 times F 2N. And that's how we solve for the other case.